they introduce cupria vitis metallogurans to a solution loaded with gold chloride, a compound so harsh it would kill most life. But this bacterium is different. 24 hours later, tiny gold nuggets start forming. The bacteria are detoxifying the gold chloride by reducing it, converting toxic ions into solid gold particles. The process is slow, but real. Over days, the gold accumulates, a glittering byproduct of survival. A few kilometers away, in a copper mine, another colony of Cupriavitus metallodurans thrives. For years, it's been feeding on metals like copper and gold compounds. The miners notice unusual deposits, small, shiny flecks embedded in the soil. They don't know it yet, but this bacterium is the architect. Suddenly, a researcher shines a light on the discovery. Dr. Frank Reith, a microbiologist from the University of Adelaide, is studying metal cycling in nature. He's talking to us from a field site in Australia, examining bacterial gold formation. We've seen Cupria vitis metalligerans in action, he says. It's a natural alchemist, turning toxic waste into precious metal. The first thing you notice is the mechanism. 